kilo, a barograph is a barometer that records the barometric pressure over time in graphical form. This instrument is also used to make a continuous recording of atmospheric pressure. The former barographs use the pressure sensitive element which is linked to a pen arm in such a way that the vertical displacement of the pen is proportional to the changes in the atmospheric pressure. This pen marks pressure changes on specially marked paper that is placed on a disc that rotates 360 degrees over 24 hours. The barometer and the barograph are basic local instruments, instruments independent of the internet in meteorology that serve to predict the weather. This time I will present, present you a very simple way using an Arduino microcontroller you can make an electronic barometer plus barograph that presents the results in a graphic, graphic form on a 20 on 4 LCD display. The basic project is taken from scheme.net by the author Amatorskin in which I modified and now the pressure is displayed in the hectopascals instead of millimeters Hg and what is much more important instead of the instead of the absolute the relative atmospheric pressure for the specific altitude is displayed which is a common standard in meteorology these days. As I mentioned before the device is very simple to build and contains only a few components. Arduino Nano microcontroller 20 on 4 I2C protocol LCD display Next BMA 280 pressure sensor board and one button Now let's see how the device works in reality First of all it takes 24 hours to draw a complete graph which in this case uh, is mid because the device has been running for several days the, displays, the display shows the current relative atmospheric pressure as well as the positive or negative difference in hectopascals for a given previous time period which is also shown below. This period can be 3, 6, 12 and 24 hours. Correct interpretation of this difference is the basis for accurate weather prediction. And now a few words about the graph. The maximum number of values on the vertical axis can be 28. Seven vertical dots on every of four rows. At the beginning of the code, the range in which the air pressure is read can be changed. Uh, e, EI, the smallest and the largest value. Depending on these values, the resolution of the graph also changes. Uh, for example, if we choose the difference between the minimum and maximum pressure to be 28, then one hectopascal corresponds to one line on the uh, y-axis on the graph. The 16 value of the x-axis represent time and the resolution depends on the selected elapsed, elapsed time value. Pressure change on the last three hours is zero. Also, on the last six hours, uh, the press, the, there is no change in atmospheric pressure. From 12 hours ago to this moment, the pressure has dropped by 3 hectopascals. And in the last 24 hours, the pressure dropped by 6 hectopascals. If the pressure continues to fall, it will be a sure sign of a change in weather and possibly rain. And now let's see how this device was made.